All right, we're back, people, and it's calmly like assessing the situation that we don't like sausage. <laughs> well, I, I just felt like I, I, and usually I like, I like these kind of arcs. Like I, I'm actually the fan of the moody character or the if dark Don character. Right, because hell, my favorite Final Fantasy character is Cloud. Yeah, so he's like the epiphany of moodiness, if anything else. But his story is done right. Like there's, his reasons are valid for being moody, and he's not an asshole about it. But Sasuke. I don't see the point of him just being an asshole. Like, or at least, was he an asshole in the beginning of the series? I, it's hard for me to remember at that point. Was he a, a douchebag or just, he was a, just a loner? A, a slight douchebag, that's it. Yeah. But I feel like Kishi wants. I do not know what he wants with. Like, why was it. Uh, let me just rephrase that, sorry. Because the point where. I, another point where I got frustrated was when Sasuke turned good, so to speak. Which, I don't get why he did. Basically, after hearing the, the Hokage story or whatever, that's what, that's what made him, oh yeah, I'm gonna, now I'm going to protect the Leaf. Even after hearing that Itachi did so much to protect the Leaf, mm -hmm. then, if anything else, that pissed him off more, like, I want to kill the Leaf. But I'm like, so now, what was the difference? So, just because you know the backstory of the villages, now you want to protect it, even though your brother did so much shit. Which, I gotta admit, I love Itachi. The strain up right there, man. Crush on that dude. He's awesome. I agree. See? <laughs> but go on. Yeah. I, oh, shit. Oh. Rapid fire. Oh. Oh. You're kind of not. He keeps moving. Just... I'm not going to let him kill me, though. No way. But yeah. Oh. Oh, well, he just dropped like a fly. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Sasuke, I feel. I know. Again, I know where they're going. I, I've seen these characters work. Like, you know, the moody one. But the fact that he gets all butthurt, the fact that Naruto Rasengan is bigger than him, which in fact means his dick is bigger. I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. I don't want to go there, but you went there though. Yeah, <laughs> but basically, because I find it very inconsistent. Because remember when he fought Gara, he says, oh, "I lost so many people. That's why I don't want other ones anymore." That's why he's like fighting against Gara and protecting Sasuke and Sasuke, Sasuke and Naruto. I'm like, okay, this is good. I like where they're going with Sasuke so far. But then, after, as soon as he finds out Sasuke is stronger than him, I'm just like, now you're being an asshole Can too? I throw the joke in again? Throw it in. Your Rasengan is bigger than mine, oh. therefore I don't like you. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, I, and his motivations and reasoning are just not valid to me. And I feel like, I know it's going to happen, I feel like it's going to happen, I don't know about you, Jan, but I feel like he's going to be uh, get off scot-free, for the most part. He won't suffer any con consequences for no, what he, he did. He'll get a slap on the wrist. Okay, he'll have little consequences for what he did. Let <laughs> be more specific on that. I don't know about if you feel that, that feel that way. It's gonna happen. Like he. No, I think me and Scott at one point might think that they're they're what they're gonna send him to send life to fucking jail. Even though he should. That the right. shit. They're not gonna do that. Because well, I, I would say, to some degree, he might get punished, but it's not being major. Even though he joined with the signing that, you know, tried, th that was a traitor. Extra 30 days in jail. And he also, he tried to, he invaded the Killer Bees village and tried to capture him. For Tossing an, an extra 10 days. And he joined an organization that, you know, were pretty much a terrorist organization. Okay, fine. 20 more days. Okay, that's pretty much just a bit. Of community service. <laughs> Yeah, you need to pick up all the leaves. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, ah, I'm just kidding. You're, not, you're gonna get us off free. That's how I feel again, because I, I, I heard that Kishi, his favorite character is Choji, but I call it bullshit. Mm -hmm. Because wait, what? Yeah, really? right. him, Choji and Killer B are his favorite apparently. That's what I've heard. Huh? Okay then. So you were surprised? Nah, it's just like really. What? Yeah, I could have sworn it was Sasuke. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> saying. I, well, I I understand how bribery has to be in a series like this. There has to be. But you're you're, for, you're doing a thing where oh because you're making it so obvious that if a character powers up, the other character powers up. You you you're doing it to the point where it's predictable and being repetitive. Like no, I mean, a, a rivalry. Not the first series to have done that. I'm talking about how they do it in the series, like. Execution wise, in the series. Well, no, same thing. Like, you, you kind of have to. Say, you, 
other series has done that. Yeah, it's it's really predictable. That's why it doesn't really surprise me what yeah. they're doing with Naruto. Like, I try to compare it with the rivalry between Goku and Vegeta. Now, they did it, but I feel like the ex execution was so much more better because I see how Vegeta was growing up. He grew up under Frieza's rule. And also, the Saiyan race is naturally a bunch of assholes. Go on. What? You no, I'm sorry. I just had, I had a moment of just like I had to. I had to laugh. <laughs> what? Go on, go on. So well, it was funny. It was funny. And, yeah, and his anger and frustration. Okay, so yeah, you kind of turning into an evil asshole in Majin Buu arc, kind of was pushing it. But he just a he's a prideful dude. He was the prince of Saiyans. He's so he's saying pride is one of the seven sins. Yeah. So it's obvious. What well, you're trying to do with it? Yeah. Pride. So I get it, I get, it. and sure, but I feel like he was more redeemable than Sasuke at this point because he understood. Um, oh, I can put it in words. Or what he had become. Like, remember when he died when Frieza? He straight up said, "Yeah, Frieza made me who I am today." Sasuke, he chose to be what he is. And sure, you could say, "Oh yeah, Itachi was the one," like you know, anger and hatred, which I'm like. Okay, you're half right with that. Itachi, probably not the best move to say that. I don't know why Itachi would even bother saying that. That was probably one of his few stupid moments in the series. But, and I get what he, Itachi wanted him to make friends, you know, be together with other people. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh huh. I can't put it in words at this point, I don't know why. Can you help me out, man? <laughs> Tell me the gist of what you're trying to say at this Basically, point. Basically. So, Kishi was trying to make a Vegeta. But he just made Sasuke like a spoiled brat in a way. And they're just trying to make the antithesis. I don't know how to pronounce that word, the antithesis. Oh. Of the literal opposite, but, you know, just the. They're doing the two ideological thing. thing. But, it's all, but Sasuke's ideology is questionable. Like, now he wants to be Okage? I know, that's, I'm trying to help you answer yeah. what you're trying to say. Yeah, that. yeah, I'm going off of that. And. It's just abysmal to me that. Like, some, the dude has done some pretty dark, bad shit, but now he just wants to, oh shit, he died. Oh, huh. I killed him. I just feel like Sasuke, the fact that Sasuke confuses me as a character because he's inconsistent, and he's just not likable. In a bad way. Inconsistent is not necessarily bad. Really? Like I can't think of an example where this could be Zaku. Kogios. Again, I, I put the argument I don't like that, Zaku, though. <laughs> that's but. the point. You don't like him because... It's subjective. You just don't like him. Yeah. But execution-wise, what they were trying to do with him, it made sense. He was the opposite of Lelouch. Even both Lelouch and Suzaku did things that didn't even make sense. They were both inconsistent characters. But that was the point. Okay, I see where you're going with it. Yeah, see. Compared to, compared to, compared to, to Sasuke. freaking Sasuke. That, there is a difference. Okay. I will argue that to fucking death. All right, come on. I want to hear it because... You can word it better than I do. Because, you know, people who do the inconsistent character, like, I get it. It's meant for character development. And it's realistic. They're, or they're someone trying to show that not everyone has this fucking unpenetrable willpower and shit. Right. Like, they're trying to make them human. That's why, like, if I use Code Geass as an example, like, I get why people don't like uh, Suzaku from a subjective point of view. From an objective point of view, you got to understand that was the intention. That he was meant to be that guy, like, is Su is he right? Is Lelouch right? Should I be more like him? Because, like, a lot of people joke about it, like, um, what was that um, saying he always said? Ends says? justify the means. The ends never justify the means. The ends never justify the means. Okay, the ends justify the means. <laughs> <laughs> like, yes, taking out of context is pretty funny, and I laugh about it, too. But you got to understand from a plot point of view that that's what they were trying to do. They were trying to... Literally, after all the shit that he just went through, of course he's gonna fucking question himself at some point. Yeah, that makes sense. So, I get that. I understand it. Like, I still don't like him, but I get it, and that's why I accept it. That's like, it was meant Everything. to be like that. With Sasuke, I don't know what they're trying to do. Or what, what, where were they going with this? Yeah, because, because it's inconsistent of how they're trying to do his inconsistency. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Dan. This is one of those moments, like, it's inconsistently inconsistent. Does that make sense to you? I can, yeah, I, I understand. In a weird way, in a, it makes sense. It makes just, sense. Just try to because, say that. Because he, he literally went from one point, I'm gonna destroy the Leaf Village, 
to I wanna be Hokage. What? This I think that's one of the things that broke me about it. That's one of the things. Oh that broke it. Or one of the things. Oh one of the things. It, it took an amalgamation of things to break me. But yeah, that's the key word break. See it didn't break me. Nothing about Naruto broke me. Yeah. I just something happened that made me indifferent. Yeah. Not necessarily bad. There, there are obviously great things about Naruto. Yeah, like but a lot of a lot of the characters are done perfectly. Like my Gaara. main issue is just consistency. Right. That's why. Remember the talk we said like, at first in the beginning we thought when someone said they like Naruto more than Shippuden, and yeah. at first we were like, no, no, that's not right. No, I agreed with him. You disagreed. No, I thought we both at the beginning, in the beginning. Like, no, I, I completely agreed. Like when I had that conversation with my friend, I was like, I actually, no, the first talk like way back, like a long time ago. Well, I, 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 I know say, for I can't say that because I never even considered that topic. More specifically, I, I, I know for a fact you said that in the beginning, but that was like way back though. I don't. I, okay, even if I did say. But it, yeah, not, by now it's the changed. The point yeah, right now yeah, point. is when he did mention it, my friend, I, like within within five seconds, I was like, yeah, I kind of agree. <laughs> because I we we said that Shippuden has be better moments, but c consistency wise, Naruto is better. When it comes to pacing and story. Kind of sad. Kind of sad. Yes, exactly. Because uh, how? Because there's too many bad things in Shippuden that makes me just say it no, it's bullshit. The, the yeah, or at least like moments where I'm like, oh okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was, I, 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 th I was expecting something completely <laughs> different. I was like, oh all right. Oh all right. Okay, yeah. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> but go on. And. I, I, and it's it was a tra it's somewhat tragic because I did not want it to happen because again, I I have some attachment to the series since I have followed it since wow, wow. when it first debuted you know, in in, in America that's when I first followed it. Yeah, it was too nominal. Yeah. I'm like oh, alright, let's see what this is yeah. about. Oh, okay. Alright. And I, I'm like okay, this, this is really good stuff. I liked it. I like Dara. Like Orochimaru is cool. He's creepy. He's awesome. I like him. Michael Jackson look like, but still he's awesome. Uh, no. Michael Jackson needs to use it. Yeah. Well, I, I was going to say something, but I felt that was inappropriate, so I'm not going to say it at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just social filter. Remember that. <laughs> but, yeah. But when it comes to Shippuden, I'm like, okay, time. I, I, I'm a fan of time jumps. Or, what is, that, is that the right term? Time, time skips? Time skips? Time skips? Talking about the year and a half thing? Between Naruto and Shippuden and Naruto. So you're a fan of time skips? Yeah, a lot of times I'm like, okay, I want to see the characters grow. I mean, and I know sometimes time skips have to happen because it's gonna take too long for them to, you know. For a series like Naruto, it was necessary. Like kind of Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z kind of thing. Yeah, it's one of those. I'm like, it's, when you have a, such a big franchise, you're gonna have to change it up a little yeah. bit. And I'm like, okay, these are older. The characters are older, smarter, more mature. I like this, quote unquote. I'm like. Um, Naruto. Yeah, I'm just saying, quote unquote. Yeah, and then I'm like, Naruto, you're acting kind of the same as the as you. You didn't change. What were you oh, doing I, those I, two I, years? I, I learned a bigger Rasengan. gun. Jeez, give me some credit. Do you even know the fact that he, the fact yeah, that I his Jutsu to problem, or at least like his unavailability of. You know, there's like so yeah, many Jutsus out know. there. You can't learn them. Yeah, one. we questioned them. Like, what, what was the point of giving him Wind Chakra besides Rasen Shuriken? Yeah. What was the point of giving him that? It's just an elemental form of a Rasengan. That's it. Granted, we're, granted, we're, it is awesome. No, no, we're not taking away from Ra that. That is a badass move. Yes. No, the the problem is that they, w we as fans, wanted to see more an expansion of what he could do more with the element. Yeah, and which the fact we didn't get. Yeah, because um, because they, they built it up kind of like, oh yeah, Naruto he has a, he has a element that's rare. And awesome was like, oh yeah, I can make blades, extended blades on my on, on the wind element. I'm like, this is cool. I like it. Okay, do something with it. All right, Russian Okay, we're Sengon, but cool we're Sengon. Okay, give me more. Like, give me Futon like, Daidapon. Be better than fucking bigger Russian. Yeah, Futon Daidapon. Like that's the one where Uchimaru, like one where he extends extends the hand and just a bunch of air that like, destroys everything in his path. All right, I learned to toss it as opposed to just hold it. He never did that. No, he tossed it when he he was fighting that tentacle guy. Oh, you mean the Russian shirt again? Yeah, the Russian shirt again. He, like he learned. Oh, he, didn't, he didn't learn it there. Oh well, he decided like this would be the best time to use it. Toss it as opposed to just holding it. Oh no, he never, he never tossed it until the pain fight. No, but I remember back then when he first developed it that he always hurt himself because it was a double edge a blade sword, in a sense. And then when he used it in the fight, it was like, yeah, 
I tossed the it. Thing I liked about yeah. So I was like, sure. okay, that's not a really ingenious yeah. moment, but uh, I'll let I'll let it go. I'll let it go. But I was like, all right, what else? Now this new show is just gonna be about I'm gonna go comedy. Back to my now, manga. So. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I know I know what you mean. Like, remember the remember that popular? Or what would you say a meme? Yeah, a meme. Where like, how do we make how do we make Naruto better? More jutsus, better character development. Give Naruto another Rasengan. No, no, the, 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 the meme was uh, give him something more with raw Sangon, more shadow clones, give him a new jutsu. That was the last one. Get out. Like get, get, the, get the hell out of here. What is this blasphemy you're talking about? Funny, yes. Accurate. Yes. 